Let's break down blockchain, demystify it if you will. It sounds complex and sometimes it is, but the core concept is surprisingly straightforward. We're going to cut through the noise and get to the heart of what makes blockchain tick. No tech bro jargon, just the basics. We'll use plain language, the kind anyone can understand regardless of their technical background. This isn't about impressing you with complicated terms, it's about empowering you with knowledge. Imagine a public digital notebook, a shared ledger accessible to everyone. This notebook is copied across thousands of computers worldwide. Think of it as a constantly updated, globally distributed database. This redundancy is key to its security and reliability. When someone adds a new page, a block, everyone checks and agrees it's legit. It's a consensus-based system, ensuring that only valid information is added to the chain. This verification process is what makes blockchain so trustworthy. It's like a global high-tech neighborhood watch, where everyone keeps an eye on things and ensures that no one is acting maliciously. What makes it special? What are the core attributes that set blockchain apart from traditional systems? Transparency and security. These are the two pillars upon which blockchain technology is built. Once info is added, it's permanent. No erasing, no sneaky edits. The data is immutable, meaning it cannot be altered or deleted. Changing anything would require convincing most of the network, which is nearly impossible. This makes the blockchain incredibly resistant to fraud and manipulation. This creates a permanent, verifiable record for everything. It's an audit trail that can be trusted by all participants. The real magic? What truly sets blockchain apart and makes it a revolutionary technology? It removes the need for middlemen like banks or governments to verify what's true. It disintermediates trust, shifting it from centralized authorities to a decentralized network. Blockchain lets the network itself be the source of truth. Collective trust, not centralized power. This is a fundamental shift in how we think about trust and authority. And it's not just for Bitcoin or NFTs. Think supply chains, healthcare, voting. Imagine tracking your food from farm to fridge, ensuring its origin and safety every step of the way. Or voting securely from your phone, knowing your vote is accurately recorded and protected from tampering. It's a tool for fairer, more transparent and accountable systems. Blockchain has the potential to revolutionize numerous industries and aspects of our lives. That's why blockchain is a big deal. It's not just hype. It's a fundamental shift in how we can organize and manage information, build trust, and create more equitable systems. Cities are amazing, but let's face it, living in one can be a nightmare. Sky-high rent, endless traffic, and bureaucracy that makes you want to scream. Our cities run on outdated systems, and people are fed up. Instead of patching up broken infrastructure, some dream of building new cities from scratch. The idea? Cities designed for the 21st century with tech and well-being at their core. Imagine a place where services work, your voice is heard, and rules are clear. It's not just about smart tech, it's about reimagining what a city can be. The dream, a city with less friction, more fairness, and real accountability. For many, the blueprint for this new city is built on blockchain. That's the vision driving the movement. So what happens when you combine the robust security and transparency of blockchain technology with the complexities of city life? How can this innovative technology reshape our urban environments and the way we interact with them? Imagine a world where your identity, property ownership, and fundamental rights are all managed securely and efficiently on a decentralized blockchain. This eliminates the need for cumbersome paperwork and outdated systems. From the moment you're born, you receive a unique digital ID, a secure and verifiable record of your existence. You can then use this digital ID to vote in elections, pay your taxes seamlessly online, and access a wide range of essential government services all from the convenience of your smartphone. You can even own property, manage your assets, and conduct financial transactions, all securely and transparently through your phone. Say goodbye to lost or misplaced paperwork and the frustration of waiting in endless lines at government offices. Blockchain streamlines these processes, making them faster and more efficient. Thinking about buying a house? Property titles are transformed into digital tokens, making them easily transferable and verifiable. This allows you to transfer ownership instantly, without the delays and complexities of traditional methods. All transactions are conducted securely, with cryptographic protection, and recorded transparently on an immutable blockchain ledger. This innovative approach significantly reduces the risk of fraud and eliminates the need for expensive middlemen, saving you time and money. Now let's consider governance. Blockchain technology enables the creation of decentralized autonomous organizations or DAOs, essentially city councils run by transparent and auditable code. 
Want to propose a new park for your community? Citizens can vote directly on the proposal using their secure digital IDs, ensuring a fair and democratic process. If the proposal passes, the necessary funds are automatically released from the city's budget, without the need for bureaucratic approvals. Every tax dollar is meticulously tracked in real time on a public blockchain, providing unprecedented transparency and accountability. This eliminates opportunities for corruption and shady deals, ensuring that public funds are used responsibly and effectively. This system forces transparency and accountability at every level of government, fostering trust and confidence among citizens. Power shifts away from a select few officials and is distributed more equitably among the people, empowering communities to shape their own destinies. Residents transform from passive taxpayers into active stakeholders, directly involved in the decisions that affect their lives and communities. It's direct democracy, enhanced and empowered by cutting-edge technology, giving citizens a greater voice in their government. Imagine a city truly run by the people, for the people, where every voice is heard and every vote counts. All of this is built on a secure and tamper-proof platform that cannot be easily cheated or manipulated, ensuring fairness and integrity. That's the transformative potential of blockchain technology in urban life, a vision of a more efficient, transparent, and democratic future. The future of our cities could be radically different, powered by blockchain and driven by the collective will of its citizens. This isn't sci-fi, people are building blockchain cities right now. City DAO in Wyoming bought land to experiment with DAO-based governance. Citizens buy NFTs for voting rights, deciding everything from land use to rules. It's like watching a new society form live on Discord. Then there's Telosa, Mark Lore's $400 billion city, aiming for collective land ownership and social good. While not fully blockchain, its principles echo transparency and shared governance. Lieberland, a micronation in Europe, is all in on blockchain for everything from justice to company registration. These projects are messy, ambitious and face huge challenges, but they're testing new models for how cities can work. They're living labs for the future of governance. What they learn, successes and failures, will shape tomorrow's cities. The experiment is already underway. Let's get real for a moment. Building a blockchain city is an incredibly ambitious undertaking, and it's undeniably tough. It's not just about writing code, it's about constructing a real, functioning urban environment. The underlying tech is still relatively new, and as with any emerging technology, it can be slow to implement, and at times, prohibitively expensive. The costs associated with blockchain development and infrastructure can be substantial. If every civic action, from voting to property registration, is recorded on-chain, can the system realistically handle the immense data load and transaction volume? We simply don't know the full extent of its capabilities or limitations yet. There's also the persistent digital divide, meaning that not everyone has equal access to the necessary technology or possesses the required digital skills to participate fully. If participation requires a crypto wallet to participate in the city's ecosystem, then a significant portion of the population could inadvertently get left behind, excluded from key civic processes. True progress in a truly equitable society must include everyone, regardless of their technological proficiency, and not just cater to the tech-savvy elite. Furthermore, governance in a DAO-run city is inherently tricky, because lines of code, no matter how sophisticated, simply cannot solve every messy, complex, and deeply human problem that arises in a community. DAOs, despite their decentralized nature, are still vulnerable to being hacked, manipulated by malicious actors, or even stall out completely due to internal infighting and disagreements among members. Ultimately, cities are far more than just lines of software code. They're vibrant, living, breathing communities made up of real people with diverse needs and perspectives. And let's not forget the crucial importance of the physical world, because you still need functioning roads, reliable water pipes, and a stable power grid to keep everything running smoothly. Building a city, even a blockchain city, inevitably means grappling with real-world messiness and complexities, and not just the elegance of clean code. The media hype surrounding these projects is undeniably huge, but so too are the very real and significant obstacles that lie ahead. Still, despite these challenges, the very effort of attempting to build these cities is pushing us to fundamentally rethink what's possible in urban development and governance. So why does any of this matter? Because it challenges us to rethink how we live, govern, and trust. Even if these projects fail, they spark vital conversations about power and democracy. 
blockchain offers a way to decentralize power and make cities more accountable. It's a chance to give people a real stake in their communities. The first attempts will be messy, but that's how progress works. Every leap forward starts with bold experiments. These projects are the first drafts of a new social contract. The dream smarter, fairer, more democratic cities built by and for the people. And that's a future worth building.